Snipers. There's more and more players. Okay, none of these are good. Just take a uh, <laughs> take a six one, I guess. Every time I check the Steam charts for this game, it's always doing well. Which is nice to see. Hope the devs keep up the momentum though. It's 1,700 players. Where when it started they had like 300, so really really good job so far. Okay, Ty is fine, nothing wrong with that. Uh, this is really good actually, I would gladly take two dragons. Like not only is taking the extra unit here just good in general, but it being a pair, I'm super down for that. Super super happy with that. Baby Dragon's a great unit. I still wish there were more dragons in the game. I wish there were more like... I don't know, I wish you could like build dragons. Is that too much to ask for? There's a dragon trash that feels nice. But like it's hard to get payoff for it. All the dragons are like great units. There's just not enough of them. Okay, if that hit the 1-1, one -one, we'd take the W. But at worst, we'd tie, so... I guess I'm okay with that. I mean, I'd rather push damage, but whatever, man. Uh, no target for the, the spell. So I guess we just take the support units. This has immediate impact, and then Mad Moon is just a reasonably okay unit early on. Giving the Baby Dragons more attack should ensure that they can snipe the back line. And then we'll become a new hero and start party time. There is a skip in our lobby, so I will be able to become skip. I'm glad this game is growing. Given the recent Blizzard news, I imagine it'll continue to pull in more players who like Battlegrounds but don't want to support Blizzard. Uh, yeah, for sure, dude. I mean, not want to support Blizzard, totally fair, you know? At the same time, like, I feel like this is just a better game, man, if we can be honest. I see a lot of people, they just look at it and they're like, oh, is this like scuffed Battlegrounds? But when people play it, like, you're just like, wait, this is just like a better game, right? It's like, you have Battlegrounds without any of the Blizzard bullshit, and that feels nice. Double price pig against first place? I don't think so. Let's see what my hero's gonna be. Trophy Hunter? <laughs> Muerte, Geppetto. Muerte would price pig, there's definitely some synergy there. There's some good synergy there, for sure. I could take Muerte with a uh, Lucky or Tweedledee for just like immediate impact right now. Then we can swap later on. I'm down. Actually, good enough, I guess. Sadly, there's no two cost. We just have to roll. Am I freezing for that? I don't know, maybe I should have. Gonna go catch a certain big lad tomorrow. Hatino's definitely giving me the impression that it's better than Battlegrounds. Yeah, I mean, uh, I think it definitely is. So uh, we'll see. We'll see how people, uh, people like it long term. Like the devs have done a great job so far. Looks like, you know, they really care. They're making a good game like to see uh you know how they keep working on it like i want to see a game go out of early access okay so lucky gives me economy which is good we're gonna stick with muerte for a while then okay so right now we have like a little bit of dwarf synergy a little bit of dwarf synergy i want to cast a spell for the spell weaver well i want to put that first place I don't really want Princess Peep, but technically it's better than the Tiny. I'm okay with spending money on Earthquake, since, you know, Lucky kind of makes up for it. This is not particularly strong, but, you know, we're getting through the early game. 
Okay, still far so good. I mean, I want to like Muerte. We're definitely just using him for the mid game, which is weird to say because Muerte is more of a late game hero anyway. I'll definitely dip into another hero. <laughs> as soon as I can, we'll just switch. Maybe I'll pick up Solhua. Okay, Urquid got some value there. That's good. Sniping the uh, stag is fantastic. We're definitely gonna win this. I do need my lucky to die though. If he doesn't die, then I don't get the value. <laughs> Yo, we got Drancer with the tier two. Hey, thank you so much, Drancer, dude. Much appreciated. 14 months. How are you doing today, Drancer? We get some loose poggers in the chat for Drancer with that top tier support. Thank you, my man. I uh I didn't really get to read what you were writing in the Discord, but if you're gonna tell me about it here, feel free to do so. If not, I'll read it after. <laughs> Okay, Fawn Stars is just fine, I think. I'm okay to pick up a pair, I have no triples. Oh wait, that's insane. Okay, wait, never mind, we're just selling these two. Wait, that is actually insane. Cause I'm muerte. Perfect has 10 health. That's really good with the Dudley right now. Okay, so let's do this. Holy shit, so this is crazy. Because reduce the cost of a random character by 4 and it's gonna happen twice. That's actually insane. Dude, Thank let's go. And then we have a 525 to just hold it down for a little bit. And Shireen as well with the tier 1. Thank you so much, Shireen, dude. Hope you're doing alright these days. I really appreciate that. Let me get some more loose parts in the chat for Shireen. Let's go. Dude, that was such a good hit on the uh, on the upgrade. Upgraded Lucky Ass Muerte. All the money I'll ever need, right? <laughs> Got home after lunch and opened up the EU playoffs to see some needless pauses. Okay. So my shop is going to be super, super cheap. Exactly what you want to see. And we take that W. Just here to clown. <laughs> okay, level 4. Pick up some free units. Okay, you know what? Fallen Stars. Nutcracker. And Lady of the Lake. Okay, I'm actually going for the build, chat. This, we are going to transition into a Nutcracker build. So it's bye, bye, bye. Fallen Stars. Watch these very, very clean transition. You've never seen a cleaner transition, chat. Yep, there it is. The Nutcracker build. 25 ass with Fallen Stars. This Nutcracker is guaranteed to work right now. Now we'll pick up the pair. And freeze for another Fallen Stars. <laughs> Uh, I don't know if I want to freeze for that actually, but <laughs> I do want to buy this. Definitely should share the mage support. Ah, uh, yes. We could do it like this. That way he gets the best of both. Yeah, that, that seems correct. Would I really freeze for that? Nah, this is probably gonna proc by itself. It's probably gonna be okay. Last breath with puffs? No, because I'm not gonna be Muerte late game. Muerte is a mid game hero right now. Just to give me money. Once we get to a late game, we can transition into another stronger late game hero. At least that's the plan. Nutcracker is really paying off right now. Get to feed on some sheep. My scary reporting can see your hand with those mirror glasses? Yes, of course. But sometimes you gotta just risk it for the biscuit, you know? Okay, another W for the good guys. <laughs> I mean, you can see my monitor, but my monitor is just my game anyway, so... <laughs> just fine. Grim Soul? What if I become Trophy Hunter? Is it time to just switch heroes now, then? See what I get? Say I already got enough value to that? Because if I become Gr Trophy Hunter, then I take the Grim Soul. Okay, we pivot into the scam build. 
Wait, is that correct? I pivot into the scam. Is that correct? Okay, I buy these for the gold. We're almost level 5. Oh, Poliwoggle. Oh, shit. <laughs> Alright, you know what's happening, chat. It's time for this shit. <laughs> I can't help myself. Cannot help myself. I don't think I freeze for that. Oh god, I kind of wasted a bunch of gold there, but... <laughs> We're gonna be fine, it's gonna be fine. You got first with pants? Let's go, dude. Okay, my 5 drop is... Wait, why didn't it work? Oh, because it proc the lucky. Oh, shit. Uh, I kind of forgot about that. It's okay. We, we can uh, <laughs> we can rebuild it. I have the technology. We can rebuild it. I'm gonna get a lot of money, I guess. <laughs> lucky got this lady. I got. I gotta take out the lucky, right? Here's another one. Duplicator. This is weird. What am I summoning? Probably not summoning anything. This is plus four plus four right now. This is a big deal, maybe. God, this is weird. So I have all this money. All this money. Really gotta find something better to do with this money. Puff puff. I wish I was level five. I wish I was just level 5. Yo, Adventurer? Queen's Grace? Is that crazy? Would I be crazy for doing that? Is that crazy? That's good. Like dwarves, characters with slay, I mean, not the worst. Wait, that's unironically pretty good. That's actually not bad at all. Let's go. That lucky was actually unlucky? Yeah. <laughs> oh, you tried to earthquake me? Not gonna work today, dude. Okay, so now I'm level 5, so now I get a level 6 unit. Uh, that's not one that I personally like, but it, it's a level 6 unit. Give me Shadow Assassin. <laughs> no, I'm I'm taking I'm ditching the Scuff Dwarf package. We were never gonna keep the dwarf package. Don't worry about that. Dwarf package is not staying. <laughs> okay, well we have a level six in it. I have another poly uh, woggle though. I'm gonna try again. I'm also level five now. So we can try and just find a book or a mummy as well. Wait. Okay, um, why buy Treants? Do I just go Treant build? Am I supposed to be going Treants? I don't really like this unit. I don't, I don't want to go Treants. I'm literally just gonna do this straight up. <laughs> That's good, right? But I'm also dying though. Dying is no bueno. Oh man, I should have gone Treant. I mean, I still can't, no. Technically, I still can't, but I, I don't want to go Treant's chat. Don't don't make me go Treant's. Okay, we'll take an Earthquake, I guess. This... I still want to run this. This is better for it to get the kill. I just need one round of it to get the kill. And then we go to level 6, and then we go from there. I don't know, it's a little scuffed right now. Yeah, we'll make it work. Give me another level 6 unit, we run it back. If I get another tree end... Oh wait, he's got a mummy? Oh, that sucks. Okay, I'm level 6 though. So I guess that's fine. I'm dying though. <laughs> I don't want to die, chat. 
Don't want to die. Train is better than Juliet. Ah, uh, yes, for sure. It is definitely better than Juliet. I agree with that. But you know what's better than all of those? The good boy. Okay, so now we just go good boy build. Wait, good boy with... Baby Yaga. Okay, uh, let's think about this. Need to use brain power. So, good boy is first place. Baby Yaga goes behind the good boy. Not keeping... No, we're never doing the polywoggles again. That's never happening. Okay, I need more good units. This is a good unit. Wait, this could be literally any other good unit too. I just don't really have the gold right now. Wait, what if I do... What if I do this? Oh, but then I have to get rid of this. And then this would proc the good boy, right? Oh man, but then I need another good unit. I guess I'll just take the mermaid, right? I literally just take the mermaid. Like this. We'll make it work. For now, this will do. <laughs> For now, this will this will do. <laughs> Why did I make my board worse? I don't think so. Adventure doesn't work, dude. She has Lay. He's gonna ruin my Grimsoul combo. I can only have one. Oh wait, you're right. The mermaid also ruins it too. You're right. The mermaid is not correct there. It worked out though. Okay, I'm gonna need you to chill, dude. Okay, well, <laughs> we have stats, because good boy gets lay with baby Yaga. So now we just need to find like any, literally any good units. As soon as we find any good units, we'll, we'll be good. I'm at 3 HP though, which is kind of scary, but it's probably fine. Probably be okay. Okay, that's a good unit. Okay. Fog might be okay. Upgrading the Grimsel would be a massive upgrade. Hey, we'll see you later, Apollo. Have a good one, dude. Technically, the rest of the board is good. So I'm just rolling for either a good spell or this upgrade. Or obviously better good units. We can definitely get units. Uh, this is better. Might as well buff health on the good boy too, right? I don't know if Fog could be good, but it could be useless. Another baby Yaga. <laughs> Am I taking that for the potential triple? Or would it be worth it to run it here to get the extra? You can just take it for a potential triple, right? Uh, okay, Mermaid has never been played. Now I roll for a one cost spell or something. Lancelot's a good unit. Can I sell to buy Lancelot right now? I don't think so, right? We could freeze for him. Lancelot has to be better than Juliet. Make Baby Yaga good. That would be the dream. That would be 100% the dream. Okay, everybody gets a bunch of stats. I'm not gonna get to proc my Hercules, but... At least we definitely win the lobby. Yo, this is actually kind of a sick setup. Because the good boy buffs himself. And then once the good boy attacks with Baby Yaga, he passes the stats. It's actually a really nutty combo if you think about it. Oh yeah, Lancelot has Lay, you're right. Oh shit, you're right, you're right. Cannot run Lancelot. Okay, I guess we just wasted my freeze then. <laughs> but man, the good boy technology, like, dude, good boy slain? Feels good, man. That's a good combo. Feels good. Okay, we need, like, Robin Wood, Echo Wood, like, other better good units. Alright, Pigamorph probably worth the purchase. Later, like, I don't think so. Okay, that's good. Okay, now let me ask a question. Uh, the good boy positioning matters, right? So the way I would do this is... I need to make sure that the good boys are both under the baby Yaga. So it would realistically be like this, right? And this is a good boy? Right, that's the correct positioning. The uh, haunted helmet's actually kind of negative synergy here. Kind of funny how that works. Uh, I think I want Hercules on the front line. Because I want him to tank the hit so I can get the treasure. And then we're looking for uh, upgraded Grim Soul. 
and better good units and I'll be unstoppable. <laughs> I saw Mr. Page get like a 27 million good boy in Trophy Hunter. Dude, that sounds juicy. That sounds very, very juicy. Pigamorph doesn't really do much there. Wait, did my baby Diaga die? That makes me a lot weaker. Wait, this guy's scamming me, chat. He's scamming me hard. But good boy gets to slay, so is that good enough? Hercules Proctus quest. Okay, we still win this. Let's go. That was kind of scary, though. This guy actually has insane amount of scam. Okay, I get to replace my haunted helmet. I mean... Sword? So, I don't need a Haunted Helmet. It's actually just negative synergy. Okay, we need Robin Wood. Grim Soul Upgrade, Robin Wood is what we're looking for. Echo Wood, of course. Uh, Green Knight is... Well, Green Knight is better than this. But it's not better than this one, because this is ranged. I also have a Baby Yaga pair, so hitting that triple would also make me significantly stronger. Oh shit. It's go time. Um, Three attack is kind of useless. I don't need that. We could just try and get for a spell. Let's not kiss, obviously. Unless I kiss the Juliet into a Baby Yaga, but like, bro, what a chance of that. No, I don't think so. Cats? Do cats do anything? They can't hurt me, right? Cats can't possibly hurt me. Alright, let's run it. Here we go again. Oh, baby Yaga got body. That's actually kind of sad. <laughs> that makes me weaker, but... It might be good enough anyway. Because the good boys, they're gonna slay. Like, good boys have guaranteed slay now. Oh yeah, we got those juicy stats, chat. We got those juicy stats. Beautiful. <laughs> and I have cats behind all these. Oh, he's still alive though. <laughs> Back row protection against the machine gun tiger. Uh, I mean, I definitely would consider it, I guess. I don't need more attack. I definitely do not need more attack. Bearstein? I don't need Bearstein either. Can I please get a Baby Yaga upgrade? One health's not gonna matter. We definitely lose if I lose. Oh shit. Blood Moon? Imagine if I got Blood Moon. I'm just saying, chat. Imagine if I got Blood Moon. Giving Baby Yaga plus 15 plus 15 probably protects it against all the AoE. But then for that to work, I have to take out the Lady of the Lake. Oh, wait, there's the tree. Wait, but how do I position that then? Wait, how do I position that? I'm not sure how I position that. Like that? But then one good boy doesn't get it? Oh, I don't know. I I needed more time to think. I wanted to protect the baby Yaga, but then does that mess up my combo? Because only one good boy gets the extra buff? Not sure. I should have thought about that a bit more. Well, we have... He passed like a thousand attack, but not enough health. Kind of funny. <laughs> My position could probably be improved. <laughs> Blood Moon would have been insane. Would have been nutty. I think we're good though. I think we're fine, right? <laughs> uh, it's a funny build. Do we kill him? Yes. Let's go. Okay, we're at least third place. Okay. It's just me and Skip. So let's think about position. I maybe don't even need this anymore. Because, like, I want both the good boys to have the buff. There's no way that I could do this. 
right? Like, it's... I don't think I need the Ancient. Just for the one round. I mean, it worked. I used it and I killed that guy. It, it did his job, right? Yeah, it saved Baby Yaga like five times. That's true. It, he did his job. He definitely did do his job. Is plus three plus three good enough on a good boy right now? I need an Echo Wood. Okay. <laughs> Alright, well that's that's easy. That was that was easy. I guess I roll for a spell. Sure. <laughs> Let's go, chat. <laughs> I don't think you need it anymore. Heart of the cards, baby. Dude, these good boys are about to pop off so hard. I don't know what Skip has, but whatever he has, it's probably not- Oh shit, Medusa's? Okay, as soon as good boy swings, we should be good. Right? I lost both the good boys, but then... Now we win, right? <laughs> uh, do I kill him is the question. Do I kill this man? Do I do enough damage to kill him? We have two upgraded units that are gonna push damage. First place! Ah, feels good, man. Good boy. Trophy Hunter. This was really a mass game, though. This was the Muerte game that I became the Trophy Hunter, right? Beautiful. 